I'm really honored and proud to stand here with three Senate colleagues who have really been heroes on this issue. They have had the courage and the vision to champion this cause for years. But the real heroes in this battle are the countless young people across the country who were brought here at very young ages, often in infancy, and who simply want to give back and contribute to this country. Not only is it the only country to which they've ever pledged allegiance, it is the only country they want to serve and the only place they want to be. And they are living with uncertainty and doubt and worry, yet persevering in their education, in their search for jobs, in their desire to give back to this country. And I am very proud to have fought for this cause as a state official and to have worked with many of these young people like Mariano Car Cardozo, who is finishing at one of our community colleges in Connecticut and wants to be an engineer or math teacher to advance the interests of our nation, others who want to serve in our military, and the young woman from whom you will hear today who is an engineer brought to this country as an adolescent and now wanting to give back. And so uh, I think this idea is one whose, whose time has come and time for America to make real the American dream through the DREAM Act.